basically this evening I have gone into full on cram mode. Classic page the night before an exam. <laughs> sunny sea and um, sip our coffees. Hello vlog, it is sunny. I have now gone down to just a t-shirt. I look a little bit silly because I've got a coat and a jumper tied around my waist but definitely misjudged the weather. Finished my coffee. Oh, when I was in Costa, I asked for a takeaway, completely forgetting that everyone's getting takeaway now. Ooh. Any updates, guys? Well, I've seen you, you might have a degree, but you can't order a Costa. Yeah, no, that's true. I'm out of practice. I panic, especially when like I haven't practiced ordering anything in months and months. Hey, guys, I am so tired. I've just realised how unfit I am because that walk has just got me so worn out. I feel like I've run a marathon or something. So I've now just sat down on the sofa. I was banking on a lift home as well from my parents. Then I bump into my parents in the town centre and I was like, wait, tell me you brought the car. And they didn't, they walked in. So I ended up walking back with my parents and my sister. So that was even more steps. Do you want to know how many steps I've done? Let me tell you. 14,000 steps today. Now, oh, let me look at my normal step count. Oh, that's actually funny. Apparently yesterday I did 200 steps. Um, that's just, hello bus. That's just because I didn't carry my phone around the house. I definitely did more than that. The thing is, I spend my days sitting at my desk and not moving quite bad. So I do need to get out and about a bit more, I think, just to get my fitness back up, live that healthy lifestyle. It was nice to see my friends though. Had a Costa coffee, it just felt so normal again to be walking into a Costa and ordering a coffee. Good evening everybody. I have been at my desk this evening working and also feeling a little bit tired. I think I've overdone it today guys. My head is just aching. Maybe it's heat stroke from all the sun outside today, I don't know. All I want to do is go to bed, shut my eyes. Apparently my auntie and my grandma are visiting tomorrow but they will just be out in the garden. I can see my camera battery flashing so I am gonna sign off for this evening. Hello everyone, I am feeling a lot better today. All I needed was a good night's sleep apparently and this morning I've done a little bit of work. My grandma and auntie have arrived, they are out in the garden downstairs. Unfortunately I'm gonna have to spend most of today here at my computer but I am gonna go down for lunch in a minute and then this afternoon I'm doing a live study stream. I have just finished my study stream and I believe my auntie and grandma are soon to leave. everyone it's coffee break time i've got a vanilla latte and some lotus biscuits today it is the day before my final exam feeling a bit worried about this one really am i am just keeping on going through past papers as i go through and when i mark them i'm making notes on my kind of crib sheet and yeah i'll probably do some more flashcards later in the day i was doing some flashcards this morning while i ate breakfast we've got a plan hi vlog i realize i haven't really updated you today but basically this evening i have gone into full-on cram mode 
classic page the night before an exam especially one where there's a ton of content at the moment i am just going through all of the past papers i've sat and i'm transferring any notes i've made when marking them in the past paper to my kind of central consolidated crib sheets just so i can solely use the crib sheets in the exam when i'm answering a question and recall any points that I've forgotten in the past because it might be likely that I forget them again. I've just done last year's paper though. When I say last year's I mean last sitting, so last September's paper and it had a question on pulling together accounts, so the balance sheet, statement of profit or loss and statement of changes in equity and I'm really annoyed it had that question because it's probably not going to come up in this time sitting and I feel like I would have been able to do a question like that and now they're probably going to ask me about profitability ratios or something and i'm going to calculate the ratios all wrong it's going to go bad i also found out a few days ago that i get a pay rise if i pass these exams later this year and that's quite a nice incentive as well you know so i just would all round be nice to pass morning everyone i'm a bit of a mess this morning but my exam starts in four minutes i'm just sat here combing my soaking wet hair because i've just washed my hair feeling a little bit tired because obviously i was up cramming last night went to bed at a reasonable time but then my sister finished work late and woke me up in the early hours of the morning while she was using the bathroom which wasn't the greatest i've got two minutes so i'm actually gonna run and put some moisturizer on my face because my skin literally feels like it's drying up but then i'm gonna get back to my computer and sit my exam yeah two minutes i've got time i'm done with exams i'm done with exams i'm so happy ah i can just relax now and know that there is nothing more I could do i think i put in a really good effort with that last one actually questions were familiar topics were familiar some of the questions i blacked my way through it always happens you know and i just came up with something i thought sounded reasonable i was like what would i give credit for and hopefully the examiner will think the same it does feel again really weird to be sitting exams at home i just don't feel it has the build around it that exams in person has you know when you're actually traveling to an exam hall or something and walking in with your clear pencil case and like the tension in the air is there or is at home i'm just like ah this is chill gonna wash my hair this morning roll into the room and turn on my computer two minutes before the exam is due to start and sit the exam i'm about to message my friends because i spoke to my friends at the weekend and they are free late afternoon slash evening today to possibly meet up i kind of want to celebrate finishing exams I might have them over to the garden for some drinks and possibly a takeaway we'll see where the day takes us i'm just gonna message see if people are about and if they're up for doing anything is the um chicken nice mm. oh should i be alighting hang on oh yeah <laughs> Oh it's yeah, that's good actually, that's good. Oh, it actually is. Yeah, it makes a difference. Oh. Don't point it towards anyone. Oh, I feel nervous. Why do I always okay. feel nervous? <laughs> Jesus. Sorry, I trust you. Ooh. So it's in the faith here. Ready, party. 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 Oh. Ooh. Nailed it. Yeah. So if I go that way, you see her head. And if I go that way... <laughs> Hi vlog, um, out in the garden. Yes, please, I would love some. Just cracked open the Prosecco you've seen there because drinks are called for this evening, you know? It's, it's a symbol of freedom from exams. Party. And party. <laughs> we had some burgers, a takeaway, and now the sun's going down a little bit. Taste test. I've been wearing He's going to taste all right morning everyone i am back to my client work and it's back to five days a week from now on i've just logged on already got a piece of urgent work to get straight onto a few emails to catch up on but yeah just need to hit the ground running this morning but really i think i'm gonna end the vlog here because that is my exam season over thank you for joining me stay tuned to find out how i did in them my results will probably come out in a few months time i'll have a little bit of a break before i need to start studying for my next ones but it won't be long and definitely over summer my studies are going to be picking back up again but yeah give the video a like subscribe to my channel follow my instagram to follow more of my journey towards 
professional qualification and i will see you soon with another video bye